you will receive power when the Holy Spirit has come upon you, and you will be my witnesses in all Judea and Samaria and to the end of the earth. What does it mean to engage? To occupy or attract attention? To participate or become involved in something? to establish meaningful contact or connection. As believers, this word should invoke an even deeper level of meaning. As Christ's followers, we are called to engage our culture, but we are equally commanded to engage with cultures different than our own. Jesus said, you will be my witnesses in Jerusalem and in all Judea and Samaria and to the ends of the earth. If this is truly what Christ called us to do, then why do recent studies tell us a different story? Why is the church so disengaged? According to Barna, approximately 40% of Christians say they have no non-Christian friends. And almost 60% of active believers had less than two spiritual conversations with non-believers this past year. And one out of 10 FEC churches reported not a single baptism in 2018. As Christian leaders, we're not living to our full potential. As culture shifts, we are failing to meet and engage with changing communities. We are failing to engage ourselves. We are failing to engage with God. If you're being honest, when was the last time you felt fully present at the feet of our Lord? Based on this understanding and the commandment to engage our world and our God, we welcome you to Engage. Through worship, teaching, refreshment, and fellowship with other believers, we want to offer both hope and help on how we can stay intimately engaged with our loving God and how we can effectively engage our culture. We are called to engage. It's time to get started.